going to say, never ask a politician if they want to say a few words. But it will be a few. But uh, look, um, can I just start off by acknowledging uh, Mark Houghton, um, Dick, uh, Milton Dick, the uh, speaker who was here, who we are returning, uh, parliamentary colleagues, um, Mills on Wheels from all around Australia, to Chris and Paul. Um, can I just say thank you for being here today to uh, brief us, to inform us, uh, and to let us know exactly where you are, what your needs are, and what your wants are. Um, it's a great pleasure to be a co-chair of Bills on Wheels uh, with my parliamentary uh, co-chair, Mark Coulton, member for Parks. Uh, we set this up, as he said, approximately 16 years ago in 2008, if I'm correct. Um, and uh, it came about by an inquiry we were doing on, uh, both on the health and ageing inquiry, uh, and uh, there was an inquiry into ageing, into Australia's older population. And we had Bills on Wheels uh, give evidence to us and very valuable evidence um, so we thought the need would be great to have uh, a friendship group, a group, uh, people that um, uh, were interested in Mills on Wheels, to be able to meet with Mills on Wheels on a regular basis, once a year or twice a year, uh, to be informed, to be advocates for Mills on Wheels, and to ensure that your views are passed on through to the people that are making the decisions in Cabinet and in governments of all persuasions. Um, but I've got to say that... Uh, uh, being uh, a member of parliament, uh, there is no other greater group than Mills on Wheels in terms of um, the great work that you do. And no matter where I go and who I speak to, when you say Mills on Wheels, every single Australian around uh, the entire nation is aware of Mills on Wheels and the good work that you do. And I'm really pleased that I speak to a few friends who are retiring and have retired. And when I speak to them, I say, what are you going to do with your time? Many of them say, I'm going to volunteer for Mills on Wheels. So it just shows the standing that you have in the community because of the great work that you do. We know that, um, as Mark said, that many, many uh, people um, that are receiving a meal once a day or once every few days, it may be the only contact that they have uh, with the outside world. And uh, having volunteered and gone out with the Meals on Wheels in my electorate uh, on a number of occasions, uh, the volunteers will say to me, this person is on their own. The only contact he has is us every couple of weeks. Um, sorry, every every day or every couple of days. And so the work that you do is valuable in terms of not just providing the meal, but providing some um, contact uh, for these people and being a first point of call in many cases. So uh, the work is important. It would cost governments millions and millions of dollars more if it wasn't for the thousands of volunteers around the country and if it wasn't for the, um, uh, the connection that you have with people on the ground. Uh, in 2012, I think it was, Mark and myself delivered the one millionth meal here in Canberra. Um, and uh, the then, uh, I think, Prime Minister went out to see that particular client as well that day. And uh, when you think about it, a million meals uh, throughout Australia in the history of meals and meals, we could be up to close to 2 million as the population is ageing, and we are an ageing population and it is ageing uh, drastically. But uh, thank you for all the work that you do. It's great to have you here. It's great to have my South Australian colleagues here, Julie, and uh, um, uh, others who are here as well. Uh, please, please feel free to call your Member of Parliament, no matter where you are in Australia. Uh, you have every right uh, to um, have your views heard on behalf of uh, this, of, of this wonderful organisation. Um, but I uh, certainly look forward to having many more meetings with you. I look forward to some of that cake. That looks absolutely amazing. Um, but if me and Mark eat a couple of those pieces, we may not fit out the door, but it looks pretty good. So enjoy your day here in Canberra and thank you very much for the hard work, the volunteering and the very valuable work that you do in our community. Thank you.